26 News at 9. News that works for you. Well, a child's dream comes true thanks to one organization, Stories in the Works. We'll show you her pre-Olympic moment after overcoming yeah, tough odds. Well, it will be a restless night for our friends with teenagers. Mm -hmm. She's excited because she's been selected to carry the Olympic torch tomorrow morning. It is a miracle for me to be running with the torch because I never thought, I could never dream that I would be running with the torch. Crystal Fullen of Friendswood is a lucky teen. She's been selected to carry the Olympic torch during the Houston leg of its travels. She's lucky in more ways than one. I was diagnosed with a severe bone cancer. About four years ago, Crystal went through chemotherapy and surgery to eradicate the cancer. Through the Make-A-Wish Foundation, she was able to go to Australia for the Olympics and be a bat girl for the women's softball team. Her passion has always been softball. At the beginning, the doctor told me that, you know, I most likely would never play softball. And I told him, I was like, no, you know, I'm going to play no matter what you say. And of course, Crystal now plays on our high school team and a summer league. Getting the great news about carrying the torch is a blessing in disguise. Crystal's father is looking forward to Monday. He's just going along for the ride. Yeah, I'm kind of excited. I don't know what to expect. There's all the people from Make-A-Wish going to be out there and a lot of uh, Crystal friends and our grandparents are all going to be out there. So it's going to be quite a day. Crystal usually runs about a mile a day. The torch run will be just a fraction of that. But she knows that with every step, she's inspiring others and being a part of his history whenever you get in like rough situations or like whenever the odds are against you that you can still pull through <laughs>